Hey, what's going on everyone? Here I have an iWatch um, 3 Series. Um, haven't worn it for a really long time. Um, so I did not have the latest version of software up to date. Um, and when I try to connect it with my iPhone uh, 11 with the latest version of ISO 14.1, it was not connecting. It kept saying that it was, uh, I think it was uh, um, giving the latest update to the iWatch and it would just stay on that window. Um, I tried it multiple times and I finally found a fix. You will need another iPhone that has software version 13.1. What you will do is pair these two together. All right, when you pair these two together, make sure that the iWatch now upstate updates the latest software version and when that happens go ahead and forget this device forget this and um, just reset do a hard reset on this uh, iWatch now the iWatch has the latest version installed in it now what you would do is go back to your iPhone uh, 11 or with the version uh, ISO version 14 um, and you will see that now that with the iPhone 14.1, your phone will connect to it. Um, it will do the update and then it'll re it will activate. I did have, uh, in the beginning of the process, um, before, um, before I even got this phone involved, um, it was having an issue with activation. The email that was on there and the password, um, it was my email, my password, and it was not going through at all. Um, I had to go back to the actual website and forget the device from the website, not from your phone. From the phone, you could you know log on through there and. and and you will see your, your all your devices, that will not work. You will have to go on your website uh, through a computer, whatever the case may be. Um, I did it actually through the phone here. Um, just go through Safari and forget the device through iCloud.com. It will not do it from your uh, from the app itself. All right, good luck.